class Y IMO set B. Everyday mathematics question number 36. A factory produces 5,312 nuts in a day. How many total nuts does it produce in the month of August and September? Total months in August and September is equal to 31 plus 30 which is equal to 61. Number of nuts produced in August and September is equal to 3,24,032. Everyday mathematics question number 37. Mr. Virma earned 60,000 in a month. He spends 15,500 on food, 19,800 on children's education, 17,600 on other items and saves the rest. How much total money does he save in a month? Mr. Veena earned 60,000 rupees. He spends for food, education and other items. Adding that, we will get 52,900 rupees. Subtracting that from the total, we will get 7,100 rupees he saved. Everyday Mathematics question number 38. Sanidhi bought 5.6 kg of onion, 4.125 kg of cauliflower, 3.25 kg of capsicum and 7.9 kg of potatoes from the market. Find the total weight of vegetables bought by her. Adding this, we will get 20.875 kg. Everyday Mathematics question number 39. Nakul wrote a number in words as follows 11,15,111. Which of the following represents Nakul's number? C represents Nakul's number. Everyday mathematics question number 40. The workers in a factory work for 8 hours 30 minutes in a day. How much time will they work in 15 days if every day is a working day? One day they worked for 8 hours 30 minutes. In 15 days, they worked for 8 hours 30 minutes into 15. First, we are going to multiply hours and then minutes. 8 into 15 is equal to 120 hours. 30 into 15 is equal to 440 minutes. So, 440 minutes is equal to 7 hours 30 minutes. Adding that with hours, we will get 127 hours 30 minutes. Another method is that we can convert... Uh, hours into minutes and then multiply and then find 127 hours and 30 minutes. Another method is that we can use decimals. So one day they worked for 8.5 hours. In 15 days, they worked for 8.5 into 15 which is equal to 127.5 hours. Which is equal to the A option. Everyday mathematics question number 41. A fruit seller has... 69,875 apples. He has to pack them in a box. With each box containing 325 apples, find the number of boxes required to pack all the apples. Total apples fruit seller has is equal to 69,875. Number of apples in each box is equal to 325. Number of boxes required to pack 69,875 apples is equal to 215 boxes. Everyday Mathematics question number 42. Neha wants to put a decorative ribbon around a rectangular shaped cloth. The cloth is 36 cm long and 25 cm wide. Find the total cost of the ribbon. If the cost of 1 cm of ribbon is 55 rupees. Perimeter of the rectangular cloth is equal to 122 cm. So she requires 122 cm ribbon for her rectangular cloth. Cost of 1 cm ribbon is equal to 55 rupees. Therefore, 122 cm of ribbon is equal to 6,710. Everyday Mathematics question number 43. Aditya had 4,200 rupees in his piggy bank. He used 3 by 5 of the money to buy gifts. How much money is left in his piggy bank? Total money Aditya had is equal to 4,200. He used 3 by 5 of the money. 3 by 5 of the total money is equal to 2,520 and money left in the piggy bank is equal to 1,680. Everyday Mathematics question number 44. Amit used 50 bricks each of length 30 cm and breadth 18 cm to tile the backyard of his house. What is the total area of the backyard? Area of 1 brick is equal to 540 square centimeter. 
he used 150 bricks so the total area of the backyard is equal to 81,000 square centimeter. Everyday mathematics question number 45. A school bus covers a distance of 87.25 km in a day. How much total distance will it cover in 35 days? Distance covered by school bus in one day is equal to 87.25 km. Distance covered by it in 35 days is equal to 3053.75 km. That's it for this video. Make sure to subscribe, hit that like button, and turn on post notifications so that you guys know I'm on a video that I upload. And I'll see y'all next time. Goodbye.